Brian Saunderson, and I'm running for Deputy Mayor of Collingwood. In confidence, uh, and speaking as a former athlete, on the Olympic level, it's often a very, very small percentage of performance that makes the difference, and usually the thing that tops you up is confidence. And you gain confidence by doing, having a plan, sticking to the plan, meeting your milestones, you'll see your performance improve, you'll see the results coming from your plan, and then you're a community that starts to believe in yourself, you're a community that moves forward, and it's a community that feels good about itself, and it shares the vision. We are at a crossroads in terms of industry in town, and we're not looking so much at manufacturing anymore, we're looking at attracting entrepreneurs, we're looking at attracting people that are thinking outside the box, we're looking at attracting the new types of employers. And to sell your town, you have to have confidence, you have to have faith, and you have to be confident the direction you're taking is correct. And so I believe that by sitting down and making the plan, targeting where we're going to go, uh, will give us that confidence moving forward. And one of the wonderful uh, ads I've seen to, that to me uh, just summarizes the beauty of Collingwood is a picture coming down Grey Road 19 looking out over the water and it says, imagine this is your commute to work. Because you can believe that anybody's on the 400 or the 401 or the 427 every day, this is where they want to be. We have to give them a reason to come here. To me, community consists of two words, common and unity. And you have to work together. There has to be a brotherhood, a relationship in your community that you're moving forward with a vision. And since coming here, I'm particularly working with the uh, steering committee, looking at the rec groups for Central Park, it's very siloed. It's a divisive uh, a, a relationship out there. And this council, I think, encourages that kind of divisive relationship because they don't have big picture thinking. So groups get pitted against each other and that is just so negative for the community and it is not good for our confidence, our pride, and moving forward. How do we fix that? We need to fix that by bringing these groups together, the arts and culture group together, the sport group together. We need to get people working together. We need to get their impression of what they want, their thoughts of what they want Collingwood to look like. We set the vision and then we move forward with that vision and you get buy-in, you get ownership. And as we start to achieve results, you've got believers and you've got confidence and you've got a community that's working together. And what I'd like you to see is, uh, is a community that's found its way forward, a community that has a shared vision and is starting to work its way towards achieving that vision. And it, this is where this whole process of accountability to me is so critical. So in the first 90 days of the next council, I want to see that community-driven strategic plan. I want to see us establish our priorities. And so four years from now, you can say they had four priorities and how many did they achieve? And it's certainly going to be my goal to make sure we achieved all four and that people know what Collingwood's vision is, that they know how we're moving forward, and they're prepared to work together to do that. I'm Brian Saunderson. We need to build a proud, healthy, and strong Collingwood in every way. Paid for by the committee to elect Brian Saunderson, Deputy Mayor, Collingwood.